what is up YouTube today with something special a stamina knife blade in heavy armor with 2H on the front bar and sword on board on the back bar let's get started on the body like I said heavy armor pariah is still the best defensive set out there then it's monster set of course Balorg what else on the back bar powerful sword pretty decent back bar set clever alchemist is probably better but powerful sword definitely better in a group. On the front bar, the 2H with Tashran great sword. We don't really need mana cut on a night blade. With this build, I have over 40% crit rate, which is kinda nice, especially with the crit damage bonuses of uh, the blue CPs and the night passive. 5 heavy, 2 medium, traits 5 impen, 2 well fitted. On the jewelry, of course, full infused. On the 2H Nirm, I should retrade it into sharpened for extra penetration, but Nirm is also kinda nice for extra healing. Then a powered dagger and a sturdy shield. Glyphs, full prismatic, like always, on the body. Full infused weapon damage on jewelry. Then a berserker glyph on the front bar. And the stamina drain poisons on the back bar. Quick look on the skills, Executioner or 2-Edge Execute, Camouflage Hunter for Major Savagery, so 12% crit, and Minor Berserk, another 5% extra damage done, but we have to flank an enemy for that. Then Surprise Attack or Spammable, it sets the enemy off balance and it stuns if you flank an enemy. Then Relentless Focus for Assassin Scourge and for 10% extra crit damage with 5 stacks. Ready our burst here. And it gives also major brutality, 20% more weapon damage and minor endurance, 15% more stamina recovery. As ultimate, what else? Incap, one of the strongest single target ultimate out there. Back bar, pierce armor for major and minor breach, so almost 9k more penetration. Race against time, our snare removable, it gives also major expedition and 10% extra critical damage. Uh, resolving vigor, our hot, a dark cloak, a pretty decent hot and it gives minor protection too. Then a mirage, pretty damn strong skill. We are, uh, keep in mind, we are in heavy armor and we have major evasion <laughs> still. So it's basically like shuffle, but better than shuffle because it also gives minor resolve. So another 3k more physical and spell resistance. Pretty decent skill here. Then there's defense ultimate, soul siphon. You could alternative go for a spare wounds that depends on the situation. As race, I'm an orc for extra weapon damage and for where is it here yeah. reduce the cost of sprint and increases the movement speed of sprint nord or imperial i find too as Bundestone, i use the thief monus for extra crit rate for non cp i recommend to use the serpent monus for extra sustain as buffoot the artium takeaway broth then attribute points 25 in HP and 39 in stamina. Potions, I use two different potions. My main potions are the tricep potions with HP, magicka, and stamina. Since we have three magicka abilities Race Against Time, Dark Cloak, and Mirage, we need extra magicka region here. That's why I use the tricep potions. Then my second potions are, of course, the resistance potions with over 5k physical resistance, stamina and health. Quick look on the CPs, blue ones are daily aim, master at arms, fighting finesse, another 10% crit damage, do the 3 buff, red CPs, rejuvenation, slippery, juggernaut and ironclad. Now some Battlegrounds gameplay footage, if you have some questions about rotation, PvP combinations, pre-buff, that kind of stuff, just type it in the comment section below, I will try to answer them as fast as possible. 
And by the way, over 80% are still not subbed to my channel. Do me the favor and click on this juicy red button. I would really appreciate it, guys. And girls, have fun with the gameplay footage. That's it with the PvP build and the gameplay footage. This time I put some fights against decent players, not against NPCs or unexperienced PvP players. I hope it's fine. Just tell me in the comment section below what you prefer more. Next build will be maybe another Stamina Nightmare build. I enjoy to play Stumbled at the moment, really. Um, but next time then with an unique AOE build with power extraction, the nightplay skill as spammable, so no brawler, no master, I'm still testing though, but should be done soon. Stay tuned for that and for more PvP content, thanks for watching, 
and I wish you all a fantastic day and I see you hopefully in the next video. Ciao!